All right, everybody ready? I, we're gonna do, we're gonna, today is all about following the one way or following directions. So I figured, oh Liam, that looks cool. I figured let's do a song where you have to follow directions and sing it the right way. It's a really quick song. It's head and shoulders, but instead of saying eyes and ears and mouth and nose, we say all work for Jesus. So you guys wanna stand up? Stand up. Whatever you do, don't bend over and hit your head on the table, okay? So we do head and shoulders. Okay, let's do it together. I'm just going to do it a couple times. I'm going to see if you guys can listen, okay? Let's see. I'm going to watch you all. Oh, good job. I see you're standing up. Excellent. Right. All are standing up. Good job, Mia. Who else is standing? Nick and Nate, Clark and Carter, Brady. Liam, can I see you stand up? I see you stand up. Okay, ready? We're gonna do head and shoulders. You guys know this song, right? Yeah. All right, let me play it on here and you can just listen, okay? All right, this is a fun one. You guys ready to listen? Yes. All right. Let me move this over here. I think when we, when we point to the when we get to and okay, we're not going to do, so when we do, we'll do head and shoulders, knees and toes, and then we'll say we all work for Jesus, okay? So all work for Jesus. Okay, good job. Okay, here we go. Let me play this. You're just going to hear it, okay, friends? <laughs> Shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, 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 and toes
right. All right, toward the arrow. If I go like this, which way are you going to look? Down. Down. Yeah. Okay, I think you guys got it. You got it. I'm going to read this now. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so you guys did really well. Now, stop and imagine how Jesus' disciples felt when he found that they knew he was going to be crucified. Okay, so what happened is they were very, were they very happy when they knew he was going to die? I'm trying to reach it. No, Nick, what were they? Really sad. Good. Mia, what were you going to say? Sad? What is that? Okay. So they were very sad. And then Jesus said, don't worry. I'm going to prepare a place for you up in heaven. When everything's ready, I will come back and get you so that you'll be with me. And you'll know the way to where I am going. Can you guys look up? Up to heaven. Exactly. Good, friends. No, we, we don't, Thomas said. We have no idea where you're going. So how can we know the way? Thomas didn't know, right? He didn't know, exactly. Jesus answered him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one can come to the Father except through me. Right, Jesus, exactly. Philip, another one of the disciples, spoke up. Lord, show us the Father, and we will be happy. Right. Show us the Father, and we'll be happy. Jesus said, I've been with you this whole time, and you don't know who I am? Anyone who has seen me has seen the Father. Just believe that I am the Father, and the Father is in me. Who's the Father, friends? Jesus! God the Father, God the Father, and then Jesus is the Son, and then the Holy Spirit. Jesus wanted his disciples to know that he and the Father are both God, and they're one. And if we put our trust in God, then we could join him in heaven someday. Where's heaven? All right. So sometimes life can be a little confusing. We don't know where to turn or what path to take, right? We have to ask our moms and dads. It seems like Every path can take a dead end, right? What, where's this pointing to? Show me. A dead end if we don't follow God. Exactly. When that happens, we just need to remember what Jesus said. I am the way, the truth, and the life, and nobody comes to the Father or to heaven except through me. If we keep our eyes on Jesus and follow his teaching, we will follow our path to the goal. What's our goal? To be with who in heaven? Jesus! To be with Jesus in heaven. And we can only come to God through Jesus. So Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, truth and the life. life. Excellent. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one can come to the Father except through me up in heaven. Okay, let's watch kind of a funny video. I'm going to show you guys um, a story video, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and let's see. All you guys can watch, okay? Looking to find this for you and I have to share my screen. Here we go. You guys see in here? Let me see thumbs up. Time to play Run for the Prize, where there is only one way to the prize. Let's see if our players can find the one way to the prize. Up first is our red player, and she's off. You guys the red player is quick off the starting line. She moves left, and then heads straight for the prize. She is not going anywhere near those barriers. She moves to a completely different side of the course. She makes a sharp turn around the bushes, but now she has come to the river of doom. Uh-oh, what's gonna happen, Frank? Hopefully friends? she's really thinking this through. Remember, folks, there is simply one way to the prize. Find it, you win. If you don't, you are out. I think 
the red tire is using a different route. Folks, I could not be more wrong. She's running full force right at the River of Doom. Does she think she can jump the River of Doom? She's going and uh -oh. going, and now she jumps. Uh -oh. Only to land right in the middle of the River of Doom. That's it for the red player. He tried to get the prize her own way, but there is only one way to the prize, and she did not find it. Folks, what a day we've had on Run for the Prize. Will our next player find the one? Friends, did she follow the right way, the one way to get to the prize? Yes or no? The red player. No, let's see what happens with this one, okay? Let's find one out. One way to the prize? Blue player, it's your turn. Blue player is very cautious, slowly moving around the bushes and carefully along the log. Great job. Now he's at the River of Doom. What will he do? Would you look at that? He found a bridge. A simple walk across the bridge has him on the other side. The blue player is very close to the prize now. One step, two steps, three steps. He made it. The blue player found the one way to the prize, and he has won. Congratulations. Well, if we've learned anything here today, folks, it's that when we say there is only one way, you have to follow that one way to get the prize. Awesome. That's exactly right. Right, friends? Who is our one way to get to heaven? Uh, let me unmute you. I apologize. All right. Who is our one way to get to heaven? God. Yeah. Who, said, who said, I am the way, the truth, and the life? Jesus. Jesus, that's exactly Jesus. right. Jesus. Okay, everybody ready? Let's stand up. Let's get our hands together here. Move your hands around. Let's get our wiggles out. Shake, shake, shake. Come on, come what's on. going on over there? I see you. Come on, friends. I love wiggling in the morning. Hey, Miss Connie, go! Woo! Clark and Carter, you guys are wiggling. Wow! Come on, Liam, you can do that. You can do it. Okay. We have to get our wiggles out sometimes, right, friends? Okay, let's talk about our memory verse now. All right, we're going to sing it together, and we're going to point up. We're going to use our pointer fingers. Now, normally, we don't point at our friends or people, do we? No. no. This time, we can point up, point forward, and then make a book with our hands, and then put our hands on our heart. Okay, so let's practice that. Ready? Point up. Oh, my God. Point up. Ready? Up. Let me see you. Awesome. Now, point forward, point at me, <laughs> good. Make a book with your hands, which is gonna be the Bible, and put your hands on your heart. <laughs> All right, okay, so let's go through, our verse says, Jesus answer, point up, answer. I am the way, I am the way, point forward. I am the way. The truth, and the truth is in the Bible, right, the truth and the life so let's say it faster ready jesus said jesus answered i am the way the truth and the life and the life let's do it one more time jesus answered i am the way the way the truth yes the truth and the life no Excellent. No one comes to the Father except through no me. No one comes to the Father except by me. Exactly. Exactly. Okay, so how do we get to heaven, friends? Through who? Remember? You get keep showing you the arrow. Yes, thank you. Awesome. Okay, so I want to go through before we finish. I want to go through and have you guys each share one thing about your mommy that you love, okay? One thing about your mommy that you love. Let's be quiet and I'm going to call on you, okay? Let's mute everybody. Okay. 
If you want to answer one thing about your mommy that you love, you raise your hand and I'll unmute you, okay? So who wants to share one thing? It looks like Nick. Okay, let me unmute you. Go ahead, Nick. Let's hear everybody. Um, I, my, I love my mom because she looks beautiful. Oh, that's wonderful. Thank you. Okay. Um, who wants to be next? Share about their mom. One thing they love. Uh, Brady, let me see here. Unmute you. Go ahead, Brady. My, I love my mom because she, she, she gives me so much love. Oh, she gives you so much love. That's what moms do. I love that. That is fantastic. Thank you, Brady. Um, looks like Liam, and then I'll go to, we'll go around the circle here. Okay. Liam, go ahead. What's one thing about your mom that you love so much? I love my mom because she gives me hugs and kisses. Oh, that's wonderful. I love it. Moms give lots of hugs and kisses, right? That's great. Okay, Mia, let's see, where are you here? All right, Mia, go ahead. What's one thing you wanna share about your mom? I don't know. Think about it, what do you love about your mom? What's one thing you love? You were raising your hand before. You said. All right, you know what, we'll come, we can come back to you. You want me to come back? Okay, what do you wanna say? Okay, we'll come back to you, okay, Mia? I saw, uh, who else was raising their hand here before? Um, Clark and Carter, you guys wanna share? Okay, go ahead. Um, because she always gives us stuff. Like, she always, like, plays with us. Oh, that's wonderful. I think all of your moms love you super, super much, right? Oh, that's great. Anything else? What about Carter, Clark? Which one? Hold on. What about Carter? You want to have anything? No? You love your mom, right? <laughs> All right. Excellent. Okay, let's go. Who hasn't shared yet? Um, there's Jazz and there's also, wait, where did Nate go? Did he want to share? Um, okay. Jazz, did you want to say anything? Yeah, okay, let me unmute you. Go ahead, Jazz, and then Nate will come back to Nate. I love about my, what I love about my mom is that she yeah. takes care of, of all three of us. Oh, she does. She does a great job. That's wonderful, Jana. Um, what about Jazz? What's one thing you love about your mom, Jazz? I love my mom because she is always with me. Is she what? What did she say, Jenna? Hang on. Because she's the best. She's the best. She's just the best, right? All the moms are the best. I love that. That is so great. Thank you, guys. Um, okay, I see Nate's back. Oh, Nate, did you want to talk about your mom, too? I saw you raising your hand. He's sad. Oh, you're sad? Don't be sad. I want to hear about your mommy. He said he forgot. Oh, you forgot. Um, come back to you. Okay. Do you want us to come back to you in a minute? Yes. Oh, there's so many things you could think of about your mommy. I know that for sure. I super know that. And if you think about it, guess what? You don't have to tell us. I want you to tell your mom directly, okay? Because that's even better than telling it on here. Right, friend? It's way better, yeah, tell your moms and make sure whatever you tell us today that you guys, make sure you tell your moms because we moms love to hear about why you guys love us because we just love you so, so much. But guess who loves you even more, friends? Mommy and daddy! <laughs> Besides mommy and daddy, who loves you more than mommy and daddy? Grandpa! <laughs> Grandpa too? <laughs> who else, who loves you the most? Who made you? Jesus. Jesus. Okay, the baby. That's right. That's right. <laughs> exactly. Jesus made us. So that's who loves us the most. God made us. 
he cares for you and he's always watching out for you. So let's pray together. We're going to do our closing prayer time and make sure you tell your moms happy Mother's Day, okay? And tell them why you love them so, so, so much. Okay? All right, what do we do when we pray? We put our hands together so we're not bothering our neighbors. And we close our eyes so we're concentrating on Jesus and thinking about Jesus, not our own stuff, right? All right, let's pray together and thank God that Jesus is the only way to heaven. We're all together. I'm going to mute you guys. Okay, let's pray. Dear Jesus, thank you for all the kids here this morning. We thank you that you gave your son to die for us and that he is the only way to heaven. And that if we follow his path, we will be on the right way and ask forgiveness of you, Jesus, that you'll forgive us and we'll follow you and go to heaven someday. Lord, we love you. We love our moms so much and we wanna wish them happy Mother's Day. Thank you for them and all they do for us. Lord, we love you and we know you love us the most. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen, friends. Oh, you got it, good, okay. So I'm actually gonna be handing out goodie bags. I'm sending them out to you guys. So I've got to a lot of you, but maybe not to all of your houses yet. So just keep an eye out. Today we'll be delivering the rest, okay? That way you have a little project to do at home with your moms and for your moms and for yourselves. Yeah, Liam's showing his, so you'll get that on your doorstep. It's, uh, I'm just dropping it off with my mask on and running away, okay? But my love is all with you, okay? All right, friends, have a wonderful week. I'll see you next week. Bye, everybody. Happy Mother's Bye, Day. Friend. Bye, friend. Bye. Thanks for coming on. Happy Mother's Bye. Day. Bye. Bye. I love you. Happy Mother's Day. Love you, too. Bye. Bye, Bye Johan. I just saw him now. <laughs> All right. Bye. Bye.